Hi guys, Ben here. Um, I'm going to be showing you how to install custom themes in Windows 7. We'll be using the UX theme patch method. You can always get uh, a copy of Window Blinds from Stardock, or there's also other software that will do the same job. It's a bit quicker, but the quality of the themes you can get aren't quite as good. So first check the description you're going to need to download this zip file universal theme patcher just place that wherever and extract it you'll get these three files depending on what version of windows you have i have 64 bit there's 64 or 32 bit you can check by going computer properties and it's just here so I'm going to use 64-bit, open that, choose the language. For you it'll say three files need to be patched, press yes. And then for each one press patch and then OK, patch, OK, patch, OK. It'll ask you to restart your computer, just go ahead and do that. And it'll be patched. You don't, it, you won't notice any immediate difference. You first need to install a custom theme before it'll change the interface. So once your computer's restarted, you're going to head over to this link, Visual Style 7. Uh, I'll put that in the description. This is a category on DeviantArt with lots of pretty good high quality themes as you can see. At the moment I'm using just a Windows 8 theme. I've got a custom start button. You can change that too. Um, so take a look through here. Choose whichever one. They they all work pretty much the same. So let's just go Shine 2.0. This doesn't look too bad. Take that one. Press Download File, and it'll download. I'm just using Chrome, so it'll come down here open that you'll get this folder right sometimes like this explorer frame that's for if you want to change the buttons in explorer up the top here as you can see I've done that um, so but as long as your taskbar is on the bottom you're just going to choose bottom you want to look it should have these two um, then you're going to go here computer C Windows uh, resources, which is, is themes, and then you can just go ahead and drop these two in here. So drag those across. Uh, oh, I've already got this theme, so I'm just going to go skip for you. You just need to paste it in there. Once that's done, you can just select the theme. So Windows 7 Shine, double click and it'll go ahead and automatically apply the theme it'll take five or ten seconds don't worry just give it a bit of time especially on the first time that you install it it'll take a little while i'm using um ultramon that's the reason the background's a bit odd but as you can see it has changed the theme got different buttons there it's all nice sleek interface but yeah that's really all there is to it you can um, see all your themes that are installed here in control panel um, yeah the one I'm using is just Aero Plus um, yeah but you can always get more themes from this site in the description and yeah have fun customizing if you like the video give us a thumbs up and thanks for watching.